Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy MX Terrence here with another. Uh, this is Decker in one video. Uh, last time I just did a deck recipe of what I was starting with, with the lice ones, and um, this is basically a deck video of of after me dueling people after numerous times, and I won my other locals yesterday, and I won not king of top four of the other one a couple of days ago, and basically explaining how lice one is doing for me in this format. And how do I play it in this format? So, uh, it did pretty good. It won me a lot of shit. And I'm gonna show you what is in this deck now. What made me want so what I want for her. So basically, I, right, you know, the double JD is normal. Hit the field, but um, the way I play it now, I gotta. I, I don't do stuff until I get giant trinade, cold wave, or whatever in my hand. You know, Luna, of course. You know, get the. I usually um drop sometimes drop a uh, foolish burial for Aaron. And they get the moon because a lot of people set now with the whole beast cards and all that other bullshit. And naturally, is you want to play kind of different now. You don't want to rush too much with the hand with the Garoff, but kind of get that or the or for Lila the, with the Foolish Barrier, but to get her to do her thing. So that's basically it. Um, I mean, yeah, Lumina, like I said. Aaron, like I said, you know, hit the back row. Not back row, the face downs. So I'm bugging down this video. It's like nine in the morning. I'm tired, y'all. Sorry, but then yeah, Aaron hits like the the nimbles. A lot of other face down stuff they play now. Uh, Ferdies, you know, try to they try to set the the um, the uh, necromancer hit that. My other decks. There's a couple other stuff you gotta watch out for. But I'm basically talking about the new format now. Uh, Arcus, one of the top cards now. Uh, saved me. Somebody tried Monster Bomb on Celestial, but couldn't do it because Arcus was on the field. And yo, play that. Maybe when I'm running two of them, but I'm gonna stick with one. That's better. Raiko, pop back row because everybody set like five cards now because Heavy Storm is gone. You know, Jane, beat over niggas. You already know how he goes. More draw power, you know, but kind of beat over the niggas as well. Uh, who else is at that fort? Not really, you know, too much, but. Okay, double Lila, of course, to get rid of that back row. You already know. Two Wolves. I say Two Wolves is better. It plays much better with Two Wolves. Fuck dropping the extra wolf. So what if you can't drop extra wolf? So what? It's better than having a bad hand. Because I play 3Ds, 3 Celestials. Now, Celestials. For some reason, since a lot of people play back row now, they don't play Starlight Row. So I don't be scared of Celestials no more. I'll be popping two back rows, which saves me the game many times. Uh... Yeah, got good. They feel as though as heavy storm is going, they don't use it. Other cards now, too honest. Same over four. Same card from before. Gores. Yo, won a lot of games. I'm telling you, man. Gores stops mad one turn kills. My boy, uh, Silver Fox, they playing with a one, one turn kill deck. If I ain't had this in my hand, it would have been over for me. Necro, of course, you ain't know. Play, do the whole synchro. And it's good to synchro to burn now as well with Tenses Magician. <clears throat> with Lila and Tenses Magician. Basically, to, um, to burn for game. Because sometimes it's hard to get back through that back row. So you have to find different options to win as well. Don't just always depend on Bryonic. Don't always depend on Goyu. You got to find other ways to win. And that's why I want a lot of games of that too as well. <clears throat> Trooper as well. Now, to the Magics. Now, this is the reason why this deck is popping. Because I came first yesterday and pulled a duality. Now, it's good, y'all. But I'm not selling it. If I did sell them, I'm selling for only a hundred, but I'm not selling it though because I like this in my deck as well. So I won this yesterday. It beat X Avis, it beat the one turn kill fish deck, and it beats uh, Mr. Mechina. And I got this because the lights ones are so broken, son. I'm telling you. One duality. Why not? So one duality, one avarice. My body, of course, you already know. Dark Hole is the craziest card. <laughs> Had no cards to fill one time. Four Mechanists. Dark Hole to shit. <laughs> Easy. Um, Monster Reborn. Hobby League. Carnation for like, the Celestials and, you know, the, the usuals. Foolish Burial. You got a Foolish different now. You can't just Foolish just for that Wolf. You Foolish for... Since I play two, I already don't Foolish for Wolf. Sometimes I Foolish for like Aaron or Lila. So I get Lumina to bring it back to pop the back row. Remember, everybody says back row. So that's the way you got to play these Lice ones to destroy back row now. You can't sit there depend on... All right, I'll knock his monster out, whatever, with the regular monster. No, you got to use this for Lila for Aaron's now. Just you got to play different. You can't play the same no more. The game's not the same no more. One MST, I took that one out. It slowed me down. I have Lila's and all that stuff. What the hell am I worried about? 
Um, cold waves to finish games quickly. Judgment Dragon kill away combo. I love it. Giant Trinade, beautiful. Two gold sarks. Get the JD or charge light brigade. When these remember, if you don't, if you have no JD in your hand, and you have nothing, get gold star for charge. Don't charge. Don't go for JD thinking it's gonna win. Because there's a lot of different stuff. Plus, people play it different now. I even go talk a damn Lila to get rid of one back row, so I know JD was fucking good. One kid was like, why would you do that? Nigga, I'm pro. There's a reason why I won that shit, you know? You got to think smart now. The staples, two Celestias. Oh, yeah, I got them ultimate bound. All three of them ultimate. Let me just show that real quick, you know? I was trying to get these shits ultimate now, one, but I finally got it. Secret charge, you know, finally. Traps, Bix is the same one from before. Two threatenings. I took the mirror force out. Threatening is way better now. Trap dust. Won three games yesterday. Torrential. Two back in this. That's all you need for that. <clears throat> Basically, I since I did a lot of shit, you know, maybe I probably get a lot of views for this video because people were like, oh, this is a good ass deck. Of course, it's great. I will show you guys the side deck. Why not? You know, it's almost probably like everybody else's side deck, so as well. Um, the two side decks is uh two. Uh, fortresses, uh, not side deck. I'm sorry, that is the uh, extra deck. But the reason why I got these two guys, I rocked two cyber dragons. Oh, side deck is okay. Then the King Ryo, you know, stop the um, the whole um, a lot of special something like Gladiator Beast, making it searching for all the other shit. I might get to put another one aside, but one is good. It's all right. You know, I got Monster Born just in case. Two guys, emergency calls to stop the whole X Saber bullshit. You know how to, and they're not as fast no more, so it's just helping you out even more. Now I use two Cyber Dragons when I fight Mechanist. Because the two, two Chimera Tech cards, I could just Magnet summon. <laughs> you say contact, I say Magnet. <laughs> two Corridors of Agony. Two Core Agony stops um, Gladiator Beast. They can't tag out. Anybody that's tagged out, such as someone can't attack or act their fate as well. You know, put this along with the tag with the um, Gladiator Beast. If people want to set so many damn cards, we just started the two dust in there. It was getting annoying. Crow's usual for this for like uh, light swans or people that talk stuff in the graveyard, like oh uh, the Infernities. Um, along with this Infernities, two crevice, it stops that whole bullshit with the Infernities as well and like black wings, or whatever. To consecrate like, uh, you know, stop all that bull crap. So now you know I'm playing. This deck is real. I don't know, to me, it this did so fucking good. It was doing real good. I heard it did good at the jump Toronto too, but I think it lost in the semifinals. But it's not this is act that this is my built version. Um, so with one of the locals, top five the other locals I did like just recently, just two. So two times I'm playing with the new Dan list, and it did it's doing fucking amazing. So. And it want me to do wildy, so hey, why not? So Judgment Dragon is still the most cheesiest card in the game. So you know why I play it. Here's the video. How you guys subscribe? You know what to do. I'm not selling the wildy. <laughs> you don't got it, but I do.